If you want to know how hard life in prison can be, you should definitely watch our picks for the best prison TV series. I said, are you being a smart ass? Sure, sure. Just trying to fly low, avoid the radar, boss. Do my time and get out. We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good TV show again. Number 10. Full house, threes and twos. Jinx, you are a jinx, man. He's leaving, come on. Breakout Kings is an action crime television series created by Nick Santora and Matt Olmsted. With a thrilling approach to the genre, this mixture of Prison Break and Suicide Squad follows a task force built out of current convicts on their mission to hunt down prison escapees one by one. For every fugitive they catch, their chance for a low-security prison and sentence reduction gets better. But if they try to escape, then their life will be made hell. Well, was it not Luke who said, but love thy enemy, be good to him, and lend him without Luke, expect- don't owe me 800 bucks. Number 9 For life Everything I do, everything I've done is about getting my freedom, getting back to my family. Do you want another lawyer? Have at it. For Life is a legal drama television series created by Hank Steinberg. Serving a sentence behind gray walls is one thing, but doing it while being innocent is another. Loosely based on the iconic life of Isaac Wright Jr., we follow Aaron Wallace, who is suffering under unjust treatment at the hands of the state and sentenced to prison. While incarcerated, he attempts to become a lawyer to turn his own case around and help others like himself. I'm the prisoner's rep. Talk about your rights. Well, then you got no problem in taking Joey's case, do you? What? What, you got a problem with my tats? Is that it? Number 8. Escape at Donimora. Okay, what's up? What's up with me? What's up with you? Painting my dogs? Escape at Donimora is a 2018 thriller miniseries created by Brett Johnson and Michael Tolkien. This is the haunting and ultimately memorable true story of a prison escape that went down in history. Based on the 2015 Clinton Correctional Facility Escape in New York, this was the beginning of a massive manhunt after the two murderers escaped with the help of a married prison employee with whom they both began a sexual affair. And uh, giving them to my wife like um, you're some kind of Picasso? Okay. So you found the paint? Yeah. Hidden in the corner of our bedroom. Well, buddy, there's nothing going no, on. No, look, I'm not your buddy. Number seven. Well done, my son. Gave me palpitations, I can tell you, Grady. Cool. Right under Barraclough's nose. Porridge is a sitcom television series created by Dick Clement and Ian Lafrenaise. Taking on the world of gray concrete and metal bars with lighthearted humor, Porridge is set in a low-security prison in England, following a habitual inmate and his absurd daily life. Often clashing with prison guards that are united by a great dislike for him, his only friend is his naive cellmate, who only adds to his surreal experiences. Oh, now look, before you go any further, the lad suffers from claustrophobia, and look at the shape of me, a ferret I ain't. <laughs> oh, it's nothing physical, I just want you to join the choir. Oh, well, yeah. Number six. Oh, thank you. You got them TV titties. They stand up on their own, all perky and everything. Okay. Orange is the New Black is a comedy drama television series created by Genji Cohen. Bringing to light life in female prisons with a witty and provocative humor, as well as shocking truths about an unjust system. Orange is the New Black follows upper middle class Piper, whose quiet suburban life is suddenly interrupted by a 15 month prison sentence. Now stumbling down the rabbit hole of a completely new life, she must adapt before it eats her up. You know they sell flip flops at the commissary. My money's not in yet, so. You creative. I'll give you that hat tit. <laughs> now get the fuck out of the way! Number five. Blackbird. When it's quiet like this, they call it riot quiet. Like the calm before a storm. Blackbird is a crime drama miniseries created by Dennis Lehane. Telling a horrifyingly honest and raw story, Blackbird introduces us to James Jimmy Keane. Once a promising rising football player with dozens of scholarships to choose from, he refused them all and became a Chicago criminal instead. 
Upon being caught and sentenced to 10 years of prison for dealing and illegal firearms, we witness how his witty charm and ability to talk himself out of anything will get him into the most dangerous deal of his life. Did you see anyone in here? No? Something missing? Number 4 Religious man, Schofield. Never really thought about it. Good, because the Ten Commandments don't mean a box of piss in here. We got two commandments and two only. The first commandment is you got nothing coming. Prison Break is a crime drama television series created by Paul Schuring. This series features one of the most memorable on-screen buddy chemistries. In this ultra-long going journey of suffering and crime, we follow two loving brothers who would do anything for one another. When one of them is wrongly charged for murder and sent to prison for death row, the other gets himself in too, just to make the ultimate plan. They want to break out, but from inside of the prison. Want me to make a little person-to-person -person call here? Hey, Wire, just take it easy. The other person being a uh, correctional officer? He's in. What? He's in. Number three. The Night Of. He seemed okay to me. You're a kid who's never set foot in a police station, Mass. How would you know that or anything? The Night Of is a 2016 crime drama miniseries created by Richard Price and Stephen Zylian. Revealing a major flaw in the system of justice, a man finds himself treated with injustice after spending a night with a woman he picked up and finding her brutally murdered the next morning. When he and the stranger stabbed to death are found, he is charged with the death penalty and now has to fight for his well-deserved freedom and innocence. Is that a time off? No, I just wanted to make sure you were okay in here. Thank you for letting us see him. May I please give him this? For me. I'm sorry, no. Rules. But a mother's prayers never hurt anyone. Number two. I got you to protect me. No. Everyone I care about ends up dead. What did you say? Wentworth is a drama television series created by Radulovic, David Hannum, and Reg Watson. Set in modern-day Australia, this exploration of prison life follows a traumatized wife who is put in prison after attempting to murder her husband. While unaware of the truth that led to where she is, we follow B. Smith's search for redemption and her journey to figure out how to survive in prison life while climbing the hierarchy within the system. But with every friend that is one, a new enemy lurks behind the next corner. So what were you into before all this? What do you mean? What do you think I mean? <laughs> what were you into? It's into you. <sighs> Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. The guy that evil uses soap. Seems it's us. It's not your fault. We're gonna catch this guy. Twelve hours. That's all we got. I've got some bad news. Perhaps you already know. Huh? The police have been in to see me. They found. They found the gun. Are you letting us out, miss? I'm letting myself in. Break your lapsticks, my love. You got work to do. Yes, miss. Hey, what just that? So where is Denny, my pal? Number one. Hey, bitch. No! Oz is a drama television series created by Tom Fontana, playing with the themes and titles of the famous fantasy saga, The Wizard of Oz, but turning it into a dark and cynical place, Oz chronicles an experimental and disturbing prison called Oswald State Correctional Facility. Throughout the series, we are shown around at the different areas within the mansion and follow several figures whose fates lie within. Some fight for power over drug trades, while others suffer under pain. You want to him? Say what? Oh, yeah, yeah, we've known each other a long time. Yeah. I've known Vern since uh, we were both doing time up in Lardner. I was 17 and, uh, you know, he saved my life from some big, dumb nigga who wanted me to be his friend. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular TV show in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 TV show videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.